I would just say I don't understand but our Western culture. I, I would just say some some American uh, uh, people's behavior can be a little unacceptable. I mean, I, I don't I, I I understand them, but some of the behavior can be a little unacceptable. Uh, like um, I think. Uh, uh, Americans are very direct. They like to, uh, you like to uh, comment on um, politics or some controversial topics very sharply, uh, directly. Like you often say, "Oh, uh, uh, your country does ha has done something wrong." Like uh, the policies in, in your in your country are stupid. You express this kind of ideas very direct, direct directly. But um, Chinese people are always very um, reserved about this. So when we uh, look at uh, American politics, we often uh, we often uh, keep the, our ideas to ourselves. Like we often don't blame or criticize um, American policies or government uh, with uh, uh, Americans. So this is. Uh, uh, so I understand this, but I think uh, sometimes the American people's uh, behavior like this can be a little unacceptable. Un okay. Okay, so the third question, <laughs> what is one thing that Westerners don't understand about China? I think the biggest one is, uh, is uh, our attitude to our government. So patriotism is a, is a very, very um, ancient and um, and um, uh, very old um, uh, uh, tradition in China. So in China, if if someone uh, often criticizes the government, many people will think, "Oh, you are negative. You have negative energy." Um, unlike Americans, I think Americans often express your ideas. Uh, very, very, very directly. Uh, not only about Chinese government, also uh, but also about your government. And sometimes you do disagree with Trump or uh, Republicans or Democrats. Then you just uh, speak, speak, speak your idea, your, your mind directly, right? You just tell others, oh, I think Trump is stupid. I think uh, uh, Democrats are liars. So many people just say that. Um, but. Uh, about our tradition, we don't often uh, talk about our government in a very negative way. Then you may be very confused about this. Why? So are Chinese people all cowards? Uh, do, do you always stay silent? Are you afraid of the government? So actually, actually it's not a, uh, it's not a, just like a, we are being, we are afraid of the government. It's like our uh, 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 it's like our government and uh, and and, our, and we. Have the emotional connections, very, very, very strong emotional connections. So we feel ashamed to um, uh, criticize our government too often. This is this is the, I think this is the biggest thing. Americans may feel confused about the Chinese people. And the second thing is like the attitude to towards our parents. Like our parents, so sometimes we don't want our parents to control us. Control us like. Uh, we don't want our parents to choose partners for, for, for us. But the thing is, usually their ideas can affect our ideas. Like um, sometimes when our parents keep um, criticizing our girlfriend or boyfriend, um, then we will feel confused. Why? Uh, is my girlfriend or my boyfriend a bad person? A bad, is he a bad guy? Is she a bad girl? Uh, why are my parents always criticizing uh, them? Right? Then our attitude can be changed, uh, influenced by our parents' opinions. Then many Americans uh, feel very confused. Why? So you said you loved you, you loved me. You said uh, like uh, uh, the American guy and the or the American girl and the Chinese man or, or, or the American guy and the Chinese girl. Um, uh, used to be a couple, but uh, after uh, the the Chinese person's parents uh, kept um, uh, kept criticizing or interfering interfering with 
their um, uh, uh, military shape, um, the Chinese person may group up with the American person. Then the American people were, were saying, oh, why are you so cruel with me? So why are your parents' opinions so important? So they don't understand. Oh, this is like our uh, uh, old tradition. Our, so even, even though now we are trying to be independent, our parents can still affect our ideas or mindset or mentalities. Yeah. <coughs> I think Chinese culture and the Western culture are very different. Um, I think uh, uh, in most people's um, um, from most people's perspective, um, Western culture is more advanced. Chinese culture is more outdated. I think most people would, would, say, would say that. Um, I wouldn't say that. I think Chinese culture is uh, uh, full of wisdom. Like Japan uh, used to study um, our culture, and their culture uh, was affected by our culture a lot. It means our culture was also competitive. Was also competitive. Perhaps in the recent. Uh, uh, 200 years, or our, our tradition was um, um, was, uh, uh, was changed. I mean, was uh, ruined by some um, politi politi political issues. Uh, like uh, we lost lots of uh, uh, precious. Um, uh, uh, like. Uh, Philosoph um, philosophical uh, works or something like that. Uh, many people just uh, didn't study the philosophy, the philosophical uh, books anymore. Then uh, the way we understand the philosoph philosophy schools and to, uh, and in the in ancient China, from ancient China, is very different from the way um, the the people in. Uh, the people 200 years ago understood the, 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 the philosophy school. It's very different. Um, then uh, uh, the, the modern Chinese people uh, often don't understand our old tradition very well. Uh, so it, it means uh, uh, it's not the culture which is uh, outdated, it's uh, the people who haven't uh, studied the culture very well, right? And another thing is, that I think, um, some people like to criticize Western culture, like uh, America, American people are uh, corrupt, corrupt, right? Like, like uh, American people uh, invaded um, the, uh, the Native American People's tribes, and and and, 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 and you kill lots of the native American Americans. It means uh, your history, your civilization uh, was uh, bloody, right? Right. Um, I think this this kind of idea is uh, uh, very uh, one-sided. One-sided. I think uh, American and the Chinese culture are both very uh, competitive. So Americans uh, need to study um, our culture a bit. And we also need to study American culture. And uh, learning English is not just learning the language. We also need to learn the culture behind the language. So just one more thing. Uh, if you could say just one thing to the American people, to everyone, what would you say? What would you want them to know? Oh, um, I, would, I, would, I would want, want the Americans to know not all the uh, Chinese people don't have uh, um, uh, the abilities of uh, critical thinking. Um, you, I, I've heard from many Americans that they, they have found Chinese people uh, can't think critically, but it's not true. It, 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 it's, it's more like Chinese people are more shy or more reserved than Americans. We usually hide, we will keep the ideas to ourselves. I think when um, the American guy and the Chinese, the American person and the Chinese person uh, get um, 
cartucho, cartucho no hice nada, tipo al tipo, tipo muy motivado, then the uh, then the American guy, the American person may feel oh this Chinese person also has a lot of uh, critical uh, ideas, I mean uh, different ideas from government, different ideas from their parents, to just uh, we are very free of speaking uh, the flow of the flow of our mind. Yeah. Okay.